What's up guys, my name is Bjorn Shen, one of the judges on MasterChef Singapore and today as part of the tips and tricks section of the show, we are going to show you how to make pizza dough. Well, maybe not make pizza dough, but you've already got pizza dough. How are you going to turn that into a nice pizza dough base for all your toppings, okay? So, flour over the seams. Eventually, you'll find that they stick to each other. It's fine. Just get flour on the seams. And if you have one of these or one of these, just go to town, okay? Cut. I'm going to cut. Gonna cut. Cut. So let's get this guy out. Slide the peel underneath, okay? And let's pull it out very gently, keeping all that gas in. Look at that, all right? Fly your board from the side, okay? From the side, don't be afraid of too much flour, it's fine. Come close, look at all the air that we have. Look at this, I'm pushing it on one side, you can see the air moving out on the other side. We wanna keep this air in, not squeeze it out, okay? So this is how you do it. One finger, go around. Dot, 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 Around the outside. Okay, look at that. Three fingers on both hands. Push, 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 push. So instead of pushing the air out of the dough, we're now pushing the air from the middle of the dough to the crust. So you're gonna have a very puffy, airy crust. Keep doing that. Put more flour. Pick it up, spin it around. Still do the same thing, press the middle, press the middle. Push the air from the middle to the sides, but don't push down the sides. You want that crust, okay? Turn it around again, do that again. Can you see it coming together? Can you see it becoming a circle now? Okay, now if you start to get to a point where you get very confident, this is what you can do. Move the flower away from the sides, pick it up. Okay, and this is what I call like little animal claws. It's like when little animals fight, they do this. So pick up two little animal claws, put the dough on one of them, on the other, and little animals fighting. Okay, when it gets big enough, push all that flour aside, a little bit more, lay it down. There we go, guys. You got a very nice pizza base with nice, well-defined edges. Good gas inside, middle's flat and thin and crispy. The sides will be puffy and chewy and moist. And then from here, put your toppings on into the oven. You have a nice pizza.